Next question. Well, hello. <clears throat> Let me clear my throat. <clears> throat. Oh, wow. Well, now that my throat's clean, I can make room for all the buttery gamer noises I'm about to make. Buttery, smooth gamer noises? Yeah. Yeah. Let's get... Let's get right into game. Hello. Howdy. Hardcore. Run. 33. Run 33. We make this new world. And we get a little bit, a little bit frisky tonight. That's, that's right. It's exactly so. We're making it big. I've had bad starts before, but you know, tonight's the night. Tonight's the night we do it. We do it real, real, real. All right, look around. We got trees, cave, big cave. Ooh, that's actually so nice. Oh, I'd love to have a little thing there because that's very dark and scary at that part. But the rest of it, so nice. Got vines, a little bit of cobble there. Let's start collecting rocks and keep one eye open. So we kind of just look to see if there's any any villages, any battle towers, any interesting and useful generation to us in the immediate vicinity. Might help to get on top of these trees because I can't see much through the thick bush. That's why. Uh, we'll look for some gravel. Oh, we're almost have enough for a pickaxe. Spruce that way, mountain that way. Nymph, if we get damage, we can come back here. It's a little chilly in this area. Battle tower, perfect. Oh, beautiful. So now we just need some sheep. We need to get some stone or some flint. We do need stone and the flint, I suppose. Flint or find a crafting bench already assembled. Yeti's over here. And I think I see some gravel. Is this any closer? Nope, that looks like the closest gravel. Ooh. We're already having some frame rate issues tonight. Not, not the best start. We'll just ignore the Yetis. We'll grab some flint. I already got one piece. Let's go for two. Just smash all of this gravel. Feel it in between my fingies. There's the flint. Oh, that's gravel. There's the flint. In fact, I'll actually pick up this gravel because I could use it. But we're going to do a little bit later. The next step is uh, find some sticks. Let's get sticky. I don't want you to think I'm stuck on an idea, but we do need some sticks. One tree monster. What a flinch. It's because I got cat-like reflexes, is what they say. I really love this, the springy noises that make that the ants make when you punch them. You just give them a little whop and they like... It's like Tigger's jumping sound effect in Winnie the Pooh. All right. So now that we got the flint, we got the sticks. We'll make a little dagger. Oh, I need to turn these into shards, don't I? Uh, where is some stone that I can just whack these on top of? I saw some cobblestone up the hill here. So we should be able to just find some here. If not, I'll just dig down a little bit and use the earth. But I think, yeah, just, just some cobble. Wait, is this one of those uh, dungeons? Is there going to be a zombie spawn in here? 
Yes, there is. Okay. Yeah. We'll come back into there in a second, because I do want the XP. Okay, that's just... Damn, he's got a fat ass. Ooh, look at that. Man's got the dumpy. He's also, um, performing some black magic. Oh, right, I forgot I'm doing this. We'll just jump on the roof real quick, smash the shards, and, uh, make a dagger. Perfect, perfect. We need grass. There's a nymph there in case we do get damaged. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. We got the fiber. And we got a quick hatchet. Nice. So we'll make ourselves a pickaxe. Let's break through the wall, smash the spawner, open the ceiling, let the sunlight in, and uh, get all that delicious XP from the spawner. Which you will turn into a fishing rod, and we're going to use that fishing rod to easily, easily topple that battle, battle tower. And some sheep. Perfect. We can use those guys for the string. Where did the, uh, the logs go? Ah, there they are. All right, and so now this is the tedious part because the yield we get from uh, these logs tends to be pretty shitty. Perfect, crafting bench. Just, just magic that on up. A few sticks. Oh, wait. Three cobble, a few sticks, and we have a pickaxe. Beautiful. We'll come back to that bench. But first things first. Let's deal with this. So we just smash to the ceiling, let the sunlight in so no zombies are spawning, and any that have already spawned are just gonna burn up. There he is out there, burning. Ooh, Ooh there's two spawners. Nice, big levels, big levels. Uh, just make sure there's no zombies in the corner that I'm missing, so when I jump down there I don't get mauled. Uh, all right, let's head in. And one music disc, okay. Well, I was in it for the levels anyways, not for uh, high yields. Is he still out there? Did he burn to death? I hope he burned to death. I wasn't paying enough attention. While I'm here, we'll grab enough for a stone axe and a shovel. Got the cobble. Lovely. Lovely. And we'll head over to that crafting table. Take the seeds out of my hand. Ah, and a nice axe. We'll get rid of this garbage hatchet. We're just going to yeet it to the stratosphere. And, uh, and Stone Axe is where it's at now. Oh, he's still, he is still around. I thought he didn't die. Well, there he is. There he goes. Nice. We got wood. So we're level five. We're going to go into a mining proficiency. And then we're going to throw this into gathering. We're going to go one, two, three, four. And then five, we're going to put into defense. So one, two, three, and then I need... Level four, and then we can put on some chainmail armor as soon as we get it. Now there were sheep down here, correct? Let me go get some wool. Specifically, wool to turn into string. Damn it. I need white sheep. Because white sheep are more common, it's more likely I'm going to get enough. Actually, I would have had enough to turn any color into a bed, it looks like. It looks like there's plenty of... All the different sheep, but I need, just need three of one type of wool, but I'll still kill them for the XP and the meat. Oh, actually, I need the chicken. I desperately need chicken to make some avian treats for later. So we'll just go on a quick animal murder rampage. Uh, I do have to be careful that we're, we might spawn a reaper. And so we just got to be on, be on the lookout, be on the edge, if you will, and uh, get ready to go ham on a death spirit if we encounter one. Apparently I can't hit a, a stationary target. Alright, there we go. Oh, we're just on a sheep kill streak. Unstoppable. Alright. So we got plenty of XP, plenty of wool, plenty of lamb. Defense up to four. And let's head back up for one more sheep. Do we, do we go for it? I think we go for it. Let's head back over to that battle tower. Did I pick up the crafting bench? I did. Perfect. Crafting bench I'm going to use to make a quick sleeping bag because the sun is heading down and I would like to uh, just go for a snooze for the night, you know? So we'll hold on to that in case I need it. And now let's head up. 
up the hill once more. And there's the battle tower, all right. Ooh, and more chicken. <laughs> Beautiful. Ooh, we can turn the cow into leather helmet. Oh, I do need some water in a second, so we'll kill these cows quick, and then we'll go for a drink. I'm really surprised with all the murder I've done. I haven't spawned a reaper. Really surprised about that. I'm not complaining that I haven't spawned a reaper. I really don't want to fuck with one right now. Now, actually, I do have enough... No, I don't have enough of that for a helmet. I was getting ahead of myself. I will have a drink so I can actually uh, see properly. And we do have more sheep down here. We do have more sheep. We got some big trees that way. Some bones that way. Okay, okay. Do be like that sometimes. And we got the uh, battle tower. That's not that tall. Is this one that goes underground? No, it's got the windows though. So I don't think this is an underground one. Huh. Huh. Is that the same one I saw before? Might be a different battle tower. When I get up there, I can probably get my bearings a little bit better though. Uh, I do have four strings so I can make a fishing rod. I will do that in just a moment. Let me quickly... Beautiful, I can knock the guy off the top of the tower. The other thing I want to make is a uh, shovel. Because I am going to need some blocks to get up that tower. So we'll just dig some dirt. We'll just <laughs> collect a whole bunch. A whole bunch of blocks to use to get up there. Let's actually skip this tutorial so I can see how much... Damage has actually been done. Perfect. There must be a setting where I can turn off the tutorial from the start, but if there is, I don't know it. Okay, here, I can get I have a better view from up here. So there's nothing that way. We do have the tower right here. And our, I see a chest. Ooh, okay, be careful. Night is coming. Let me get ready to hop in the bed as soon as I can. Just get a bit more dirt before. We have more levels. Mining's next up. So I can dig up iron ore if I find any. We're hoping for ender pearls. We're hoping for blaze powder at the top of that uh, top of that tower. Those what we're we're fingers crossed we're gonna get. Especially the ender pearls. I want to be able to make a. Uh, I saw a chicken. I went. Was it just a. Yeah, there he is. I want to make a soul stone so I can bind a rook to myself. That'll be fantastic because then flight is opened up to me right off the bat. Oh. Alright, well. I guess we'll explore this tower. I don't see anything else nearby immediately. So we got our dirt. Maybe I'll grab a little bit more. And let's just head on in. Okay, something already spawned. So this is one that goes down. I see there's a floor below. So that's, uh, that's okay for me. I can just get on top. First thing I'm going to do, though, is, is get that water down there. I need, I need a quick drink. I'm a little parched. Particularly parched. I made the achievement Monster Hunter. I don't remember killing a zombie. He must have burnt to death after I punched him, which triggered that for me. Because I did not... I, I hear I'm getting closer. Oh. Yeah, I definitely didn't kill any zombies. They're just kind of killing themselves on their way to get to me. Which, I'm not... Oh, holy, did he just drop a backpack? What the fuck? I'm not complaining. Certainly not complaining. Hot damn. All right, let's sort this, sort this. Take that, take that, take anything I can. Uh, iron? Sure, I'll smelt some of that down. I can I can totally just smelt down all of this wolf armor into, into ingots. It drops a hearty amount. Uh, these are the bones down here. Nice. Um... 
before we do that, let's get up top onto there. Oh, that's just that's just a sky house. Okay. Uh, flare almost useless because we can't use it. It's got, it's got the funny number, guys. That's the that's the nice number, eh? 69420, that's pretty funny, guys. Come on. Anyone want to say nice? Nice. Alright. We'll get up the tower real quick. Lightning fast. People will be so impressed by how quick I am. Oh, there's holes on every side. Wait, no, no, no holes on this side. Is this a clean side to go up? Yeah, okay, this is the one. This is the side we'll travel. Get to the top because the top shouldn't have anything spawning because of the sunlight. I swear I just did something getting damaged. I don't want a burning zombie to jump on my head. And we'll just fill that on up quick, quick, quick. Beautiful. All right, so levels. There's levels to it. You and I know. We got emeralds. Nice. Iron. Nice. Nice. Alright. I'm going to pick this stuff up first. I need to figure out what's worth taking. Bones are good. Useful. Moss stone. Don't care about. Yeah, that's about, that's about all I need from here. Uh, let's open up the light. Up here, over top of the spawners at the very least. Minimize the spawning, but I'm still not going to go in there. I'm just going to... What is this side with the chests, though? Is it this side with the chests? You know what? I can't... It doesn't seem to be. I think it is closer to the stairs. No, it's like the middle of the room. This is a weird structure. Ooh, careful the griffin. And we do have those guys spawning. So let's... You know what? Let's just start heading down. I think the iron's good enough, and I'm, I'm content taking that backpack we got down there. Um, I don't want to fuck with them right now. So I'll, I'll go quick as I can, and we'll just, just slow and steady, try and, try and grab some of the, some of the good shit, if you will. Let's break through. Look for that. Fuck it. Okay. And drop the wool. I don't need that wool. And close that. Oh, wait, I want that. Oops. There we go. Oh, no, don't dig down there. Yeah, that's a, that's a yikes for me. I don't have any food to run. Um, we're just gonna, we're just gonna stroll this way. You, I don't want to go too far because I don't want to lose that backpack. Let's head back over there. You know, I could put the backpack on for now. I don't have any other armor I could wear. I could make wool armor, I suppose. It's better than nothing. But probably not worth doing. Okay, he's right there. Let's just grab it and go for now. And then I'll sort all this stuff out in a moment. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Come on. There we go. Alright. And we'll dig up this. And let's just move. Let's find a place to uh, settle down in. Do you like the bones? It might be cool to look somewhere like there, but I want a better battle tower. Ooh, that's a house. As places to settle go, this looks pretty uh, finished. Break the leaves in front of the door so I don't accidentally have an ant popping out when, I, when I'm trying to get in in an important time. We'll break it down now so I don't have to deal with one later. Back up a little bit. Back it on up. Nice. Alright. Seems like a pad. Yeah, no, it got a got a bit of a hole up here, so we just do that. Beautiful, beautiful. Same with right there. Perfect. Oh, it's dark now. It's very dark up here now. Mmm. Okay, I see why the previous previous designers decided to make the choices to put holes in the holes in the ceiling. I might just do that for now. Or you know what? Even better. <laughs> I 
I think it's perfect. But maybe just in case. Alright, so moving down here. I want a chest. So I am going to need some some wood. We'll make a saw. And that'll make making wood a lot easier. And we do get to do a almost a double chest. A single chest for now, that's fine. And we will place the backpack down. Let's just kind of sort out some of our uh, some of our some of our stuff. We're gonna make one furnace. Don't have any coal, so I'm gonna have to smelt my wood, which is fine. We have plenty. Put like half in there, and we will smelt down a lot of this. So we do have one piece of coal. Well, I'll save it. It might be better to have torches for now. We have a saddle. Some strings, some bone. Just take it all out. And I don't care for the wood swords. I'm going to use these first. Uh, that'll be good for... The wolf armor. And we'll have a second sword ready, just in case it doesn't completely cover the distance. But it's just... Oh, it's just... It does it perfectly. Look at that. Look at that, and we got seven iron ingots. Perfect. Manuscript won't be useful till later. Let's make a bunch of nuggies. Bunch of nuggies. Maybe it's not worth making chain. Maybe it's better to go into a Paxel first. Oh, but a chain helmet is just so nice. Oh, it's a toss-up. Okay, let's do enough for a helmet, and then that's it. Because having a helmet will probably save my life. But now... Now we can make a Paxel, or at least try to. We already have the axe, so we need a shovel and a pickaxe to make the, the top of the Paxel. So shovel, pickaxe, beautiful, marvelous. And let's just put them all together. We get a Paxel head, nice. We can make the rod, we can make the guard, and the guard is just, oops, all of that but one level lower. Beautiful guard, and then we do this beautiful bar, and then we have to make a uh, fucking forging station. And then the rest of this iron will turn into armor. I need level six, which is fine, we'll do that. In, uh, in mining, finish that, and now we'll go into our building. One one off from six. We're almost there. So we'll hold on to these pieces. In the meantime, let's make a lot of chain. A lot of chain. All right, we'll do chain chest plate, chain boots, and I am going to need a little bit more for the pants. Got 10, perfect, that's more than we need, but you know, <laughs> thick leggings makes it a little bit slower, but it does give that a little bit more armor. So I'll take it for now. Let's cook this up. We'll just use six pieces of wood. Hopefully it gives us enough levels to, uh, to make a second furnace to cook the meat. Make it out of the floor. You know, we should just sleep so nothing spawns around uh, around the house. It's probably for the best. I know it's safe in here, but uh, it's a little bit better if we don't have shit like creepers outside, you know? Alright. We got six. We need two more pieces of cobble. And I'm going to just fill the floor back in with our gravel. Honestly, don't even notice the difference. Beautiful. Second furnace right on top. And we'll use this one to cook the meat. I hear a zombie burning out there. Nice. Nice. All right. 
So we'll just kind of try and get close to get some of that XP as all of this smelts. We need level level six in building, and then we can make ourselves a Paxel. And we're pretty we're pretty well equipped, all things considered. Let's turn this. And actually, save that. We don't need any more. Uh, we don't need any more mail. Let's just turn these back into nuggets. We did waste a little bit, but. I'm not that stressed about that. Not the end of the world. Oh, the bucket though. Let's go fill this with water. Just be careful because there is lots of shit outside. Okay, let him come close. We'll just let him burn up on his own. Perfect. And let's start killing the trees around the house so that way nothing can live in the shadow. I should make a shield now that I'm thinking about it. So let's go back in real quick. Speedy like, and I need four cobble. One, two, three. Perfect. And then, you know, we'll just do boop, boop, boop. fill that back in. Uh, shield. It's one stick and then a little shape like that. Perfect. And then we use our cobble. And now we've got a stone tower shield. So if we do run into any skeletons, we can at least attempt to block some arrows. Might not be successful. But we can certainly try. It's so close to me. I'm surprised he hasn't noticed me. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Yeah, we made eye contact. Oof. Oof. You're a goner. Alright. I love all the flowers around here. The fairies are going to help keep me alive. Level four, level five. I might go kill some more sheep just to push for level six. Just do need to be careful because my, my axe is almost broken. In fact, let me go make a new one because I don't, well, they don't need to make a new one. If I hold out for a little bit longer to get the XP some other ways, then I don't need to worry about making a new one because then I'll just do oh, it's a creeper right there. What I'm trying to say is if I wait a little bit longer, I'll just have a new Paxel. And I don't need a I don't need any stone tools anymore. That's baby stuff. Who needs stone tools? Let's cook the beef. Add to that XP coming in. Do you got chicken too? What I'm gonna do tonight? Gonna wait for it to become nighttime. I'm gonna stand on the roof, wait to some wait for some rooks to come. I'm gonna make some rook treats. We're gonna tame one. We're not gonna have enough to make us make it soul bound. It won't be soul bound to me, which will be unfortunate, but we're gonna use the rook to fly to some battle towers and just start pulling shit off, and we're gonna get enough pearls that way. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed, he says. To uh Well, to to make a soul stone and bind him to me. That's the, this is the gameplay. This is the, the big brain strats right here. So let's make sure first it's cooked chicken, right? Cooked chicken can be turned into avian treats. Yes, cooked chicken makes avian treats. We got seven. We have enough for five. Let's cook these up too. But don't eat them. Don't eat them. Level six. Beautiful. Building six allows us to do this. We'll just plop that right there. We can just make a beautiful Paxel, and we'll just put all of that into here, because I don't need that right now. I was going to get water. That's what I was doing originally when I left the house. Let's fill that bucket up so I have a drink with me at all times. And then we need to find a Rook. A Rook would be nice. Should I grab some bones while I'm at it? I am going to need bones to make bone meat on that as well. You know, I'll take bone meal for now. You've got lots of sheep, golden nymph. There's the water. Beautiful. Anything else around? Nope. All right. Let me take that off my hot bar. Have a quick drink before I head back. Let's go see if that chicken's done cooking. Uh, 
steak is done. Chicken's done too. One more for the steak. Beautiful. We got the bones. Perfect. Bones, bones. Can I turn bone meal into bone? Okay, this is what gives me bone meal. What can I do with bone meal? Anything interesting? Is it worth collecting the bone blocks? Doesn't look like it. Anything? What can I do with the bone blocks? Can I make them into anything? No, I can turn them into bone meal. Okay. Well, in that case, let's just make some some avian treats. We got four. Let's try and get eight. So let's try and kill two chickens. Let's go on a chicken hunt. I'll put this in the back of my inventory. I'll keep that on me. You know what? I'll keep that on me. And let's just let's just keep working on deforestation. We don't we don't want trees around here. No trees. No, no. Trees, disgusting. Disgusting things. All right, beautiful, beautiful. So we're looking for chickens. Look at all those chickens. You're kidding me, there's a dragon right here? Oh my god, okay. Okay. So things have suddenly got a lot more intense than they were just a second ago. Things are much more intense because there's a dragon spitting distance from the home. And so what that means is we got to completely avoid line of sight with the dragon because if he sees us we're toast. And we go that way. Tonight we, um, well, maybe not tonight, let's go now even. Grab the shit, most important shit we can, and let's get out of here. I'll take this. Um, I will use the backpack for now because I don't, I don't want to leave too much of this behind. A lot of this is useful. We could just replace it later. Uh, redstone, redstone. I'm gonna get plenty of quartz. Maybe keep, maybe not. Bandages definitely want. Put on the hot bar. Don't need cat healings. I will take. Uh, could make bread. Could make coal. Black wool. Black wool. Okay, I'll stack that. Maybe it's best just to turn one of these into string. And ink sack. Don't need leather. I'll keep. Guess I'm leaving the rest. Oh, but the dirt is... Well, I'm going to get a flying bird tonight is the plan. So, you know what? Maybe I don't need the backpack. Maybe I'll just bring it. Come on. Come on. Dig up. Oh, yeah. Nope. All right. We leave out the back. And let's, let's book it. Get out of here before the dragon catches wind of us. It is getting late. Which is exciting. Because I do want to use nighttime to find a rook. I was hoping to just stand on top of my house in safety. I feel like safety isn't something we're going to have now, now that it's nighttime. I could go to the top of the battle tower. I'm a little worried that I'll spawn some gins, which I don't really want to deal with, but I feel like it's a little safer. We're just going to stay away from the dragon as much as possible. For now, anyways. So let's just climb up on top of a tree. And we're just going to spend the night uh, looking for a rook. Shouldn't be too bad. Hopefully. How did... Okay, yeah, my water's glitched. Alright. Uh, which tree can I get on top of? You know what? Let's just... I don't know why I brought that instead of the dirt. The dirt would have been so much more useful. Let's get some more dirt. Oh, I can't heal myself yet. Okay. Ooh, this might be tough night. Maybe I should have stayed behind, but you know what? We don't we don't risk it when it comes to dragons. So we just gonna we're just gonna chill. We're gonna watch the night sky. We're like Batman. Perched above Gotham City. Looking for crime, and in this case, we're looking for birds. We're looking for some avians. Why do I have this flint knife? Okay, the flint knife's going. So 
So as night comes up, hopefully we'll have some rooks spawning. And because I'm high up, hopefully they'll uh, they'll be able to find me. Except it's getting so cold so quick. Let me go back down because I'm gonna have hypothermia in a second. Oh. Can you give me some night vision real quick? Thank you. See, it helps me see guys like that. Scary zombie guys who just want to kill me. They just want to kill me. That's all they want to do. And I'm not about that. I don't want to die yet. Oh, another battle tower. Nice. Nice. I'm going to enjoy exploring that in a second. It's still cold. It's still really cold here. Looks like it's going to get colder if I continue going that way. But you know what? That's warm. Maybe I should go to there. Okay, I don't see any rooks. Don't see any works. Maybe I should just sleep. I say to myself, thinking. But at the same time, I'm like, you know what? Maybe I should just. <laughs> Gotta keep moving before it gets too cold. Get out of the tree. Out of the tree. Come on. It's a cold night. Okay, but I don't think I'm gonna get hypothermia. I think I'm gonna warm up. I think it's my elevation that's making me cold. Okay, that's a skeleton. Avoid those. Creepers, trees, spiders, more spiders. See, the issue is I'm going to run into something really scary that I'm not able to deal with in a few moments, and then I'm going to be panicking. And I don't have a plan for that moment. I'm really hoping I find a bird who can just take me up off the ground and all my problems are just going to disappear. That's what I'm hoping to find. But, uh, I have my doubts. I have my doubts. I really do. Come on. Get up this leaf. Come on. Make it, man. You can do it. You can do it. You're a big boy. You got you got big jumping legs. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There we go. Any birds? Really not feeling like birds are around here. Kind of feeling like there aren't any birds around here. Kind of feeling like a lot of death, so maybe it's time I just... Put down the, the sleeping bag, but at the same time, no more are gonna spawn if I put down the sleeping bag. And so I'm I'm at this I'm in a pickle. You can say I'm in a pickle. Take the planks. Okay, I can't jump on that right because I'm, I'm I'm a little bit too short because my feet sink into the leaves. Go up for a hot second, hot second up off the ground. It is a structure. That's also a structure. No birds. Oh! <gasps> yeah, game. Come here, gamer. Come here, little gamer. Come to Poppy. Come to Poppy. Yeah, you you want some of these. <gasps> he loves me. Yeah, boy. Come here. Come here. Yes. Hell yes. All right, very quickly, we got to sleep. Where's my sleeping bag? There's another rook. Oh, that's a... Dr that's a something. That's a something I don't want to fuck around with. Let's just land. That looks like a place. That's some horses and some... Some... That looks a little scary over there. Let me G to dismount. Let's get in this house real quick. Have a sleep. Prowling around outside. Good thing is I can fly to get out of here. But you know what we do? Moments like this, when you're a little bit scared, you just kind of... Oh, there's a whole thing up here. What? Huh. Weird. You just kind of climb up onto the roof. When you clearly saw something moving... Is that a baby lion? That looks like a baby lion. Okay. You know I said moments like this, you do that. Moments like this, where the rook's just gone? Um, with your saddle? He just took the saddle and dipped? Uh, moments like this, you just kind of have to cry. Because I don't, I don't have a good way out. Well, there's uh, mini lines after that guy. Well. There's no dragons here, at least. No dragons here. Plenty of water. I heard the bird. Maybe I just need to... Maybe he's just invisible somewhere. Hold on, let me really quickly. Hopefully this doesn't despawn. <laughs> we'll do the old classic 
save and quit. And hopefully, he comes back to me. There he is, there he is. Oh, beautiful. Okay, so now all we gotta do is go to the tops of a whole bunch of battle towers and loot the shit out of them. That's the game plan. Let's wait for the world to load back in. And we're on the hunt. We're on the hunt for some battle towers. That's uh, it's just a village hut. It's not a whole village. Is that a, that's a statue? I don't want to wander up that hill because I have a feeling there's going to be lots of snow and cold air up there. Uh, we will just kind of keep moving. Just keep moving, you know? Keep the eyes peeled. Uh, head on a swivel. That's a battle tower, but that's not what I want. I want a tall one so I can just get the treasure from the top and I don't have to dig down and deal with, with things like a dragon over there. Nice. Well, good thing I can fly. Okay, here's another big tree. Um, but it's just cold biomes. Is it worth flying through it? Am I going to freeze to death before I get to the other end? That's a dragon on my right. Well, he's going to keep me warm. Wouldn't you say? He's going to keep me a little too toasty. And I don't really want... I don't want to deal with that. I'm feeling like that is not what I want to do. So, you know what? Let's just... Let's hop, skip, and jump over this way. I know there was a dragon over there. In fact, I don't remember seeing him before. Was that the same guy? I thought there was one there. You know, maybe there's two. And I'm just going to keep moving. There is that place, which is pretty cool. Yeah, he's just destroying that area. That area is toast. And that's, oh, a village. I might stop there to get some food and some supplies. But it doesn't, doesn't make me pleased that it's so close to the the very scary threat of the dragon but you know oh nope every time i see a cobblestone tower i think it's a battle tower for a spit a split second and then i'm immediately disappointed immediately okay that's a library there's some cool enchanted books in here i'll link to this so i can get back here if i ever need to um We'll really quickly just swing in here, grab some of the wood. Link, take that, take that. A little bit lower, come on, come on, anything. We'll take the planks, got enough planks, okay. Yeah, no. Uh, manuscripts, I don't even think I need manuscripts. I could probably just turf it, but on the safe side, I'll hold on to it. Ooh, blacksmith. Mm, but I don't want to get off the rook again. I'm really worried I'm going to lose the rook if I get off of it. It's probably worth it. This is just a battle tower ruin. Now I would love to find... Oh, that's a dragon. I'd love to find an ocean. That's another dragon. Turn this way. Turn this way and pick up a little bit of height. Who's gonna, I'm going to go into F5 mode. Oh, ooh, this is what I've been looking for. Come to Papa. Come to Papa. Let's get all that good shit from up here. All right, so what we do now, we get close. Not too close. Close enough that we can hit him with the hook. I think I'm hooking him? I can't tell. Let me get a little closer. I don't want to get too close. Oh. Yeah, let's be quick about this. Okay, that definitely hooked him. So we can hook him from here. Yeah, and so we just build up all the momentum, all of it. Just get it, get it nice, get it sizzling. Kind of like that dragon sizzling the forest down there. And then we get close to him, piss him off, and he's just gone. Kaboom, bye buddy. So let's loot this. Uh, End of pearls is what I desperately need to soulbound this guy. So let's do that, grab these, grab that. Um, take that. Dragon's down there, coming closer, real close, real quick. Glowing, glowing ingots, we'll leave that. Um, and you know what? I'll take the saddle, just in case. Find the miner's ring. Okay, I'm getting greedy. Let's just go, let's just go. <laughs> Dragon's down there, we're getting shot at. Let's stop and soul bind the rook, so I don't lose him. So I can keep him on me. I just need to find a good place to land. That's too much fire in that thing, it looks like death. 
Is that fire? You know, I can't tell. It looks... Lava. Yeah, I know. I'm not dealing with that. That does look like death. Um... We need to replenish the fishing rod. The fishing rod took a number there. I'm pulling the big guy. Anything around which, which is relatively safe where I can just park for a bit? Park and sort out my items. We got cows. Ooh, this biome looks nice. I want a village that doesn't have a dragon immediately next to it. That's what we're, that's what we're looking for. Go back into F5 mode. Let's keep my head on a swivel. And nothing. Ooh, Squidward's head. Lava. Maka. We have a tower over here, but not a battle tower, just a tower tower. Spruce trees. Plenty of them. We have the ocean. Ooh, another battle tower. Okay, we'll loot this guy in a second. Uh, so let's let's sort out my items here. While we're here, let's stop and have a sort. It is getting late, but it looks safe enough, relatively. Let's take off. Get off the rook. Oop. Hold on a second, rook. Uh, we need to make some... Makes, make a few things. So, first things first, I need to make a soul gazer. So, I believe that is four gold. Four bones, other way around. Bones and gold. Yes, okay, and then it's four diamonds, one, two, three, four, and four pearls to make the soul stone? Yes, it is, perfect. All right, where'd you... Damn it, okay, I, I'm assuming he just, it's the, the I need to re-log and log back in to get him to respawn. Really quickly, though, let me just put the soul gazer into there, put down the sleeping bag, and I'll just real quick re-log, and let's get him bound before we lose him. Let's get him bound. Okay, I hear him. I hear him. Where'd you go? Oh, there you are, buddy. You're in the tree. Okay. Nice. He's been bound to me. Perfect. So I can now dismiss and summon him at will, which is fantastic. Um, so what I'll do, what I'll do while I'm here, I need to replenish my fishing rods. Let's just turn these into some sticks. A couple more sticks. I think I left the string behind in the previous tower, but you know what? We got lots of wool. Make some more. So we can just keep knocking off these towers. This miner's ring, I think, does nothing, but I'll just wear it for now. Because haste. Nice. Oh, attack speed. I swear it didn't say that just now. Maybe I, I just missed it. Because I'm blind and stupid. Um, I'll also, you know, while I'm thinking about it, let's pop this XP. Put it into something useful. Um, but maybe before we do that, we just have a nice, nice, nice lie down. Can't do that just yet, so we'll get a little bit more XP. My magic. We're gonna get enough to make a summoning staff. I think that's level eight in order to uh, use it. Alright, Rook. I'm, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna be riding you in a second. Don't worry, buddy. Take your time. We just uh, just gotta level up some more, you know. And then we'll go into once we finish magic, we're gonna go into defense. Get some iron skin. Only sleep at night. I'm, looks looks like night to me. Come on, come on. There we go. Quick as I can, so nothing spawns. And I need to set up a temporary place to work from, a temporary base. I would have done the village because I want something I can waste them back to. So as I fly away, I'll have a way to get back. Um, 
you know, I'm just going to turn all the wool for now into string, because I have a feeling I'm going to need more of it. Uh, and then this stuff I'll just kind of leave for now, because I can always craft more. Drop the stick, I'll take the crafting bench, that'll be more useful. And let's get on the back of my rook and get out of here. Get out of the tree, come on buddy, come on. Alright. So I don't, I don't want to loot that yet, because I'm not going to have enough inventory space to take the good shit out of the top. Maybe I'll... Oh, let's go a little bit lower so we don't spawn those assholes. Is he still on me? Okay, no, they seem to have gone. Do these things have spawners in them? Because I might just make my home in here. That's just regular lava, not... not okay, good, not dragon fire. Ooh, that's a little scary to have next to your house, though, that ravine. Could have shit coming out of that. Um, what's in the forest this way? I don't want to go too far from that battle tower because I do want to just come back and loot it. And I don't want to build right on the shore because I'm, I'm going to have a sea serpent just come flying at me if I do that. And that will make me, that will not make me pleased. Alright, let's, let's have a look over here. Let's follow the coastline because then I know how to get back to the battle tower. And let's see if I can find anything that I can kind of just make my house. Those are those are sirens. Oh shit, I should make earplugs if I'm flying near the water. Okay, uh, let's stop at this camp. Got a camp right here, perfect. This seems like a good enough place to make a base. Let's smother the fire. Tons of plaster, love it. Ingots, ingots, love it, okay, okay. And bones, more bones. Perfect. Okay, this is pretty good. So let's go ahead. Fill this on up with my stuff. We'll keep the meat, keep the bandages. Uh, we will ditch the rest, though. That's just, that's his foot. For a second, I was really worried there. I'm like, what is that? No, but it's just, just his foot. Ice bucket challenge, deep purple. Nice. This is really annoying having above my skills. Is there a way to unequip any of these? I'm not sure. Oops. Alright, so we'll just stick all this in here. I'm able to keep some blocks on me. And what I wanted to do to deal with the sirens, a couple of buttons, make it earplugs. So that way, if I start to get called to them, I can put in my earplugs and save me, hopefully. Hopefully that will save me. But we'll try and avoid them altogether. So I don't need this much plaster. I can use that magic for, I think I can use this too. I'll keep like one slav and one plaster. That should be fine, more than enough. Put that up here. Don't think I need anything else from in here. So we'll leave that as is. Where there you are, buddy. All right. Let's go. Oops. Magic six. All right. So we'll go get that other battle tower. And that's what the next plan is. We're just gonna keep doing the tops of battle towers, just looting them as much as I can. Why are you riding a bird? Um, bird makes my life so much easier because I can avoid the dragons by flying, and I can just come to the tops of these and and then I'm gonna make the boss this is gonna be really you're gonna enjoy this so I just get I just get nice and close to the boss I get close to him and there he is oh this one's a special golem too he's extra strong so I get close enough there's a dragon right there so just be careful but I get close enough that I can he just took down so many trees hit them with the, the fishing rod and all the momentum is gonna build up every time I reel him in so just keep reeling him in reeling him in real quick because I do need to yeet out of here as soon as that dragon gets too close and then I get close to this guy, and then he's just going to go. Boop, bye. Because of all the momentum that built up. And now I just take all of this. Quick, 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 quick. And I go. I go. I'm out of here. That's dragon fire and the guy shooting fireballs at me. Both of them. He's angry. I think he landed somewhere down there. His fireballs are kind of delayed. I don't want to hold still for too long. Let's head back to where that little camp is. And we got a whole bunch of cool stuff. And so now the plan is we just keep doing that. We just kind of keep it going. There's the camp. 
We are kind of close to fire over there, so we just got to be be aware of that. But um, it's all it's all good. We get off the bird, and we have a whole bunch more diamonds. A recall potion is gonna save my life later. Um, I do need to set a spawn point. <laughs> One more potion, which will teleport me to someone. We do got tons of pearls, so we can finally make a summoning staff. And the rest we're going to spend towards, um, ender pearls. We're going to go for the portal. We're going to beat the game. Beautiful, beautiful. So let me just make sure for summoning, I haven't ran into any, um, the only thing I can summon right now are Ents. That's disappointing, but all right, I'll accept it. We need to find some uh, Aegis. Some Aegis would be lovely. And now what we also need to do, this is level eight magic to use. So we need to level up to use that. And then the rest of our, our levels are going into armor. So I can make some, uh, some diamond, some iron, something better than the chain I'm currently wearing. So what we'll do now, what we'll do now is, come, come here, come here, come here, let's go over the ocean. Let's go for a fly over the ocean. Um, I'll keep my earplugs in so the sirens don't get me, and let's look for battle towers over the water. Reason for that, if I pull those guys off the top of the battle tower, they fall in the ocean, I think they're going to drown. And then I think the whole tower is going to come down. Because once those guys die, the tower falls and I can just take all the good shit that comes out. And that sounds nice to me. That sounds exciting and easy. How come every one of these is in the vicinity of a dragon? Can I just have one of these where I don't have a dragon chasing me out after I loot it? I just want some peace and quiet while I loot. Get closer. Close enough that I can fish him. I think I got him. I think we're hooking him. No, that's definitely hooked. Oh, I broke my fishing rod. We'll use the other one up and then we got to make a new one. Fishing them in, reeling them in. All right, that's enough. Oh, bye. Bye, buddy. All right, load. Tons of XP potions, recall potions, and we got a blaze rod. Hell yeah. Okay, so he's in the ocean somewhere. We'll come back here, see if he drowns. But for now, let's head back. Back to land, back to shore. And, um... I'm gonna use these XP potions and we're gonna we're gonna level up a little bit. We're gonna get some magic going. Fingers crossed anyways. I also do need to sleep in a bed now. So I have a spawn point set. Because currently, I'm gonna drink one of these recall potions and I'm going somewhere completely random in the world. So I do need to have a spawn bed set. And so this orange bed is now gonna be my spawn. And it's just gonna be right Right there. In fact, no. No. That's a bad spot. It's gonna be it's gonna be in the fire pit. I need enough space so that I, I can actually spawn without it being obstructed. So we'll, we'll make it in the fire pit. So I, I sleep I sleep there now. That's where I sleep. I'll put this back on because I'm not near the water. And then let's just uh level up a little bit. What do I need? Yeah, level six first, okay. Level six. Now we need seven. Seven. And then I need level eight. Perfect. Magic is leveled up. Defense is next. Five. And defense. Now we need six. And seven. No seven. All right. So that's what we're at for now. We'll put all these in here. If we can find a desert, we can make a dragon's eye, because we're getting so much material so quick. Uh, which is really good for us. We are doing well. This is a really good run. I don't know why I'm keeping the diamonds on my hotbar. just makes me feel wealthy. We'll just open that up for now. Alright, um, sort that as much as I can. Keep some plaster on me. Pearls I don't need right now. I will keep the wood on me. I will keep the saw. 
I need to make more fishing rods. That's what I was doing. So I'm going to need wool. Well, good thing these are made of wool. But first things first, let's have a quick snooze. I can only sleep at night, so I got to wait a little bit. Okay, that's a reaper came out of the bed. Give me nightmares. There we go. Kill them like, like no problem. Let's get iron armor. Iron armor will be our fast track into a uh, big boy, big boydom. What other rings can I make? Let me have a look. I want to have a uh, enchanted eye ring is going to be useful. I'll make that as soon as I can. Golden carrots. I don't have any carrots though. As soon as I get carrots, I can make that. Ring of the fairies I can't craft, can I? No. Withering I can. I need a wither skull. Um, I think I just, yeah, it gives me immunity to withering, which would be really useful. It's heart of the sea? Yeah, I saw it there. Stone of the sea. So I need prismarine crystals, and then I need fish to make that. But I do, I'm, I'm getting, I'm getting my equipment together. So we'll get the string from the wool. It's just flying around me. Boop. All right, and we will turn these into sticks. We will go one, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, one, two. Beautiful. Two more fishing rods. Should be plenty. We'll keep the recall potion on us so we can get out if we need it. And now I should be recalling right back to here, hopefully. Hopefully. Oh, and you know what? Oh, I'll just make new ones. Why not? Earplugs in so we don't get sirened. Let's get back over near the big guy, Mr. Big Explosion Man, and we are just going to chill to see if he dies in the water, because if he does, that tower will crumble and I can pick up all the good stuff from the bottom, because the second floor is also typically pretty good of the tower. I mean, I could just go up now, I suppose, and, and break through the ceiling, let the sunlight in so nothing spawns, or hell, I could even just fly in through the window, but I would risk getting shot by a skeleton or something. Grab, 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 Okay, that's good enough. And I'm out. I'm out. <laughs> Don't want to risk too much. Dragon is still down there, wreaking absolute havoc. Ooh, spicy frame drops. River banding, too. Alright, we'll just look around, see if anything else is around here. We did get some more enchanted bottles, which is nice. Horsheimer. Actually, I could put this on, uh, it's crumbling. Well, I could still put it on my bird. Uh, which one is this? A potion ring? Of It's clunky. Not very good. Uh, brewing stand. Can't use yet. Need building. We could make some potions later. What kind of structure is that? I don't think I've seen one of those before. Hmm. Ooh, Cyclops and a desert. Okay. A, no, wait, yes, desert is... That's, no, it's not cactus. That's just a beach. I've lied to you. But you know what? That is something. That's a battle tower. And I do have some inventory space right now. So you know what? I'm just gonna... We're gonna do the same trick once more. I'm a one-trick pony, but uh, that's okay. Don't need that much to get this done. All right, one, two, three... Four, five, six. That should be plenty. Oh, that was not plenty. He's very close still to here. All right. Well, let's just then grab and go. The old, the old dine and dash. You know. Uh, put that in there. Take the blaze rods. We'll put that. They don't need the books. Bucket bread. Uh, and horse armor. Don't care about. All right. Cool. Good enough for me. So more than six next time. We're gonna do like seven or eight. Because he did not go very far. Not very far at all. 
I should make a book so I don't get lost. So I can make my way back here if I need to. I do have a castle, and I think there is some cool loot that can spawn underneath it. You go into the dungeon. Don't really want to deal with some of the stuff that spawns up here, though. So let me just head back across the water. And we'll use the levels to try and get some iron armor equipped. A little bit of iron armor would be uh, quite the look. Okay, Battle Tower guy, are you still in the water here? I don't know. I don't want to hold still because he could shoot me and then I'm dead. There's two siren things, one there and then one over there. Ooh, glad I got earplugs. All right. So we land real quick. Oop. Let's first things first. Let's put some of these into levels. Leveling up. Need seven, and then we need eight to wear iron. One off. Ah, there we go. All right, we can do iron now, which is dope, which is fantastic. Um. I'm going to rush to diamond because I think that would probably be the most useful I could do, useful thing I could do. We'll get to 10, then we'll need 11, and then 12 will be next step on my list. Maybe, you know what, I'll put a little bit into agility so I can use a bow. Let's make a nice bow. And then what else? What else? I can wear iron now, so maybe I'll just do that to be safe. We will make an iron helmet. Put that on. Iron chest plate. Put that on. And in the meantime, let's just store some of this stuff right on into here. Throw it on in. Throw it on in. We'll take some of this stuff from here and we'll put it up there as well. We'll try and we'll try and organize a little bit more. Because if I plan to take on the Ender Dragon, I'm gonna need lots of arrows. Lots and lots of arrows. And preferably a, a good bow to match. What is that uh special bow? Maybe just bow. It's green. Is that it? Oh that's it, the switch bow. Makes an eye of ender to make, so I could totally make that right now, but I need attack eight, agility six. So maybe actually I'll put my levels into those for now. One more in agility and then all into attack in order to make a nice switch bow because I believe, I actually don't know what these do, but I think it's it's pretty good because you can make a switch bow pedestal, which makes me think that it's fancy enough to have its own pedestal. It must be a pretty good weapon, though I don't know that. What I do know is, I need more iron to actually wear some dope ass iron gear. Got all the diamond in the world, but iron? Nah. Not enough. Keep the sleeping bag. Oh, but I do have horse armor, which I can now. Oops. Wait, which way is it? I gotta uh, get off of him. And then I believe it's shift and right click him. Shift right click. Yeah, there you go. There you go, buddy. We'll put the armor on you. Now you're looking snazzy. Put these down too so I can kind of just smelt some of this stuff down. Uh, I need my planks. There we go. And we'll just turn the chain back into ingots. So we'll just smelt that real quick. Can I smelt the, uh, these on their own? No, okay. No, I can't. We'll do that then. That should be fine. Lots of bone. I need bobbles. Bobbles are going to be useful to me. All right. Cool. Cool. We got all the ingots. We'll smut down the boots as well. Heavy boots. Don't need them. This should give us 
two. Okay, that gives us enough for iron boots. Which will make us a little bit a little bit stronger in the feet. Alright. Night is coming, so we will be off again in the morning. We'll sleep first though. Sleep here first. Um, oh, you're just a fairy. Nothing wrong with a fairy. We're gonna need more iron. Maybe I should make a flint and steel to keep myself warm, but you know, it should be fine. Get ready to sleep. Actually, I should be using the iron. I, I ditched the redstone, didn't I? Oh, I have more. Perfect. Let's make a compass so I can get back here. Make a compass. We can use that with an ink sack and a feather. And we can make ourselves a nice book and quill. And then we can turn that into an atlas. Are you kidding me? Okay. Azure Reaper. Oh, I can't see for shit. Just keep moving. Oh, we lose them. All right. Where? Where? I don't see them. Oh, no. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, that did happen. Hmm. I could have, hypothetically, I could have used that wormhole potion, broke the bed, used the wormhole potion, and gone somewhere else entirely new in the world. I made a few mistakes. I, I lost sight of him. It was the first thing. I probably, if I stayed on him, I probably could have hit him a few more times and maybe killed him. Or I could have completely committed to running and hiding, which is the other thing I probably should have done. But instead, I just kind of stood out here like an idiot, confused and lost. Instead of making a break for the inside and, and kind of covering until I can see again, or um, or doing anything else that wasn't just what I did. But you know what? You live and you learn. And next time, this is our best run yet. It was quick too. It took us an hour to get to where we were. Holy shit, that was fast. God, last time to get close to the diamond it took us like three hours. This time, one hour. Oh, so so speedy, and we almost we had enough pearls and uh, blaze rods. We could have we could have made it into the end for sure. So next time, do all that again. Gear up a little bit more, and the dragons as good as ours. We're almost there. So we'll end things tonight. We'll end things tonight. And it's time to say good night and uh, goodbye to everybody. I hope you all have a good time. And uh, I'll talk to you all soon. Ta-ta. Ta-ta for now.